honestly thought I'd be more upset than this, but to be honest, I came here and I made the final. And I'm still in the top five. I... I can, sorry, I'm, I'm starting to well up. I can feel it now. But in the past year, people have been saying to me, like, it's okay to finish. Because I was in a really, really, really low point in my life. Um, I was struggling so much. I was seeing a psychiatrist. I was on medication. It was, it's been one of the hardest years of my life. Um, people have been saying, like, it's okay to finish. It's fine. You don't have to carry on. And I said, I am not finishing this way. It is not going to end this way. So I can walk away, and even though I didn't medal, I can still say that I ended on my own terms. I went out the way that I wanted to. <laughs> Sorry, I know this is, this is quite emotional because I... <laughs> because there have been so many times when I thought, I remember saying, if I have to crawl to the block on my hands and knees, I will do it. <laughs> and I'm just so proud of myself for getting this far because... I've been in agony this whole year, and this is a story of triumph. This is not a story of defeat. I am so proud of myself for getting this far, and this is just showing people that what threatens to weaken you will not conquer you. You will overcome it, and you will end on your own terms. You are in control all the time, and I prove today that I am in control of when I finish. I am not being told.